Once again, hello everybody, welcome back to The Guest. Okay, we have a new room ahead of us, which I have barely really stepped into. We've only tried the light switch here, which seemed to open up a secret door behind a bookcase, so who knows what else this room has in store for us, really. Okay, the light switch doesn't work anymore, never mind. Let's see, let's, uh... Well, let's examine the door, I suppose. It's quite dark. To Oversight Center A. Restricted area? Oh, <laughs> not to me, apparently. I was expecting that to be locked. Oh my goodness. That looks very futuristic. Oversight facility area A. Okay, all right, we'll get to that. I promise we will. But to start with, let's explore this room here, the the study area, if you will. Okay, so we have a, uh, a grandfather clock, I think. Sure. Um, there's that painting that I saw earlier. Let's see. Okay, the lantern. I should light this lamp. I would love to, but I think the lighter that I've got... Right, it's empty. Um... Do I have anything that I could actually fill the lighter up with? What's that? Alcohol? That probably... No, that's not gonna work. Can't combine that with anything. Uh, okay. Anything else? I've got so much shit, and I think half of this is actually shit and just not useful to me anymore. What about on the second page? A magazine and a razor. No, that's not going to work. Okay. Well. Maybe there's something in here that I could use to fill up the lighter to get the lantern on. That's what I'm hoping. I'm not seeing any more light switches. Not in this room anyway, so... I don't know. Okay, let's see. Um, I assume this isn't going to turn on. No, that's broken. Right, let's go around the other side of the desk and see what we got. Ooh. Oh, whoa, whoa, hang on. Quite a lot, it looks like. A couple of... Couple of sheets of paper. Is that another magazine and a typewriter? It is. Another Science Odyssey magazine. Okay. So, this time, four letters a circle. We have C, T, O, and R. I'm just going to make a note of those, like I've been making a note of the rest. Okay, C is underlined. I'm thinking that these letters, they're an anagram for something, some bigger word. Maybe it starts with C. I think that's the first time I've seen a letter that's been circled. So, we have B-E-N, E... Oh, hang on, maybe it's not an anagram at all. Be Benefactor? Benefactor? Yeah. Benefactor. Benefactor. What the hell does that mean? I assume that's the word. That's, that's so coincidental. That can't be an anagram for something else, can it? Benefactor. Okay, I'm going to keep it like I do with the rest of the books. Okay, so let's see. Let's examine the typewriter. Okay. There's such a glare on the paper, I can barely see what's on it. Can we actually use it? Yes, we can! Okay, so there's actually nothing on it. Until I type loads of L's, apparently. We're missing a key. We're missing R. We're missing R. Okay. Do I have to... make... an R key? Can I make an R key out of all the things that I've got? I wouldn't be surprised, I've got quite a collection. Ah. Uh... Probably not. I, I'm thinking we probably have to find it. Um, so I can type a lot of letters. I can't seem to, to go down at all. I don't have to write a paragraph. Right, okay. Okay, let's delete that. We'll come back to that, I think. Okay, so there's a pair of glasses. Can I actually use those? I can, yep. Yeah. Keep it? Sure, yeah. Why not? <laughs> I'm sure a lot of these items that I'm picking up are just red herrings. They are just there to fill the inventory and nothing else. Okay, two sheets of paper. What? Dr. Leonov's speech? Wait, someone was in here writing my speech? Or, better yet, was I in here writing my own speech? No way! That would be a twist. Perhaps the pills, they make me forget. Perhaps I was the one that's been... Yeah, I'm the one who's been setting up all these puzzles that I've been tackling. Okay. Okay, and, and the one to the to the right of it? Oh, okay, that's, that's page two of it. Yeah! So it's either I've come in here without realising and... and wrote this all down, or someone has been doing it for me. I don't know which one I want to believe. There's so many questions I've got at this game still. I, I'm really still not sure what's going on here. And that's really good. 
I'm noticing, though, that on both pages, the letter R is used multiple times. So after this was written, somebody ripped the R off the typewriter, threw it away, hid it somewhere. I don't know. But it was definitely written before the typewriter was damaged. I don't know if that's relevant. I'm just going Sherlock Holmes for some reason. Okay, um, exit out of that. Right. So, a couple of shelves. Ah! What's that? Irene is not dead. Really? Really? Now this is interesting. I think Irene went through the same thing I'm going through here. The same sort of puzzles. She might be in a hotel room next to me or something. So she didn't... Her body wasn't found in front of the Citadel, right? Good. That's good. Perhaps I'll meet her one day. Let's see. Okay. Um... Right, there's a couple of drawers over here. So, nothing. Ah, what is this? Oh. L please tell me that's lighter fluid. Keep it, keep it. It is lighter fluid. Okay, perfect. So, let's combine that with the empty lighter. I have a filled lighter. Let's use the filled lighter with the lantern. Right! Oh, much better. Oh, there's another shelf over there. What the hell is that? Let's see. Another lantern to use. Much better. Okay. Hang on. What does this say? Be sure to remember the exact time of your login. Right. Okay. What? 3... Tw no, not 3. 4... 422? 23, 24, something like that? 420, something like that? Sure. Okay, let's go back round here. Oh, God. Oh, what the fuck? I just noticed, and I feel stupid for saying this, but I just noticed there wasn't actually a wall here. What the hell is all this about? Hang on, can I, um, can I pick this up? Oh, come on. Pick it up! Just pure darkness. Okay, I can't go too far in it. I'm bumping into something, probably a wall. I just can't see it. Very strange. No light switches, no lanterns that I'm seeing. I have no idea. Anyway, right. Let's go back to the desk. I believe there's another drawer that I have yet to have a look at. Nothing in that one, unfortunately. There's a piece of paper down there, which I can't seem to use. Okay, so I think that's pretty much it for the desk. What is this? Alright, okay, so the globe. Northings and Eastings, okay. Look at all these cities all over the world. Have I got to pick one of these out? This is certainly to some sort of puzzle. Bumping into Hawaii? No, nope, can't see it actually. Um, okay, U.S. of A. Boston, I guess. I'm in Massachusetts, right? So I'm quite, I'm quite close to Boston. It must be around there somewhere. 412, the 412 area, 312 maybe. Sure. Okay. We can slow down as well. Oh, I see. So we do have to be very, very specific where we point this thing. I, I don't know how this is really going to help us out, though. This is referencing something I don't think I've found yet, so let's exit out of that. We'll come back to it, as we've, we're coming back to a lot of these things, it seems. Sure. Okay, so that's that. Um, I do want to go in there. Let's just have a look at this shelf, though. This has, has caught my eye. We can actually pick it up. That's interesting. I'm going to keep that. What exactly is that classified as? A cryptex. Okay, let's take another look at it. Okay, I might be mistaken, but I'm pretty sure that the symbols on this thing are the same symbols to the puzzle that I found in the bathroom, so I think we must be going back there soon. Okay, and I can, I can use it. Maybe I have to insert it somewhere? That's it, though. Just, just two symbols on each... On each row, on each column, six of them. Okay. Sure. Okay, so that's that. What about these books? Anything else really catching my eye? It doesn't appear to be that way, no. I don't think so. All very standard stuff. The, uh, the grandfather clock, can I open this? No, play with the pendulum? Apparently not. Sure. Um... Okay, right, let's go to the Oversight Facility, Area A. This is its like something out of Resident Evil or something, you know? Resident Evil 4? 
Okay. Oh! <laughs> it's the radio? It was the radio. Okay, well, let's continue to listen to it. Why not? It just keeps going. Oh, well, maybe it doesn't for me. I guess these are actually locked up. Fine. Right. Bloody hell, we've got a load of things here. Okay, hang on. On the, on the chair, there is a... What is this? Oh, very fancy. Oversight Department Room Supervisor I-313. We science. Of course you science. Okay. So, that's an ID card. Right. right. Let's see. Hang on. Those are... Are those pills? They are. They're not mine. I shouldn't take them, though. Yeah, and I can't consume. They're Amidal, though. Okay, so there's three pieces of paper here. Let's start with the leftmost one. Let's see. Uh, text overlay, I suppose. This is everything that I did. Absolutely everything that I did. It's all been noted down. Subject tracking. Let, okay, hang on. What about the second page? Yeah. He consumed the pills and suffered an overdose. He fainted. He woke up and took the dehedron. That's what that shape was called. I was wondering, actually. The dehedron. Okay. Looks like he didn't see it before. It still doesn't quite explain how it ended up on the table in the first place. But does that mean that someone was here monitoring my every single move? While I was going through that in the other rooms. Okay. Let's exit out of that. And this one? Okay. So, get the room ready for the subject before his awakening on the selected date, which was today. And there's an orientation film in the room. Sure. Write down all his actions, which he did. So, I assume there was someone here until about five or ten minutes ago, and they probably legged it. What the hell? When you have everything under control, write a false press note about the disappearance of the subject in order to erase his data from the records. Is that like Irene Sadu apparently being found dead outside a citadel? This is some conspiracy level shit right now. This is amazing. Okay. So once you're done, collect your papers and leave them in the container outside the oversight area A. Right. Right. Ah. Oh. So... I think there's someone in there. There might be a few people in there, actually. And there's screens all around here. Is this how he was watching me? Okay, what's this? It's like a TV or something. It's got a little control pad, though. Oh, there's something down there as well. Okay, let's see. Enter? No. No, that's not working either. Um, Just out of interest, where does that wire go? Let's just see. Let's just follow it around the table. Oh, it goes into the back of the TV, which uh, doesn't seem to be plugged into anything. Not conventionally, anyway. And what's this? A access 029... <clears throat> 0297A? I don't have any... Oh, yes I do! I do have an ID card. Yes I do. Right. Ah. Ah! Enter your password. Okay, so there's a thousand combinations we have to deal with. I would prefer not to go through this with trial and error. I prefer to actually think about this and really feel like I've achieved something afterwards. So... A three-digit number. 313? That was what was on the ID card. Yeah? No. Okay. Well, 999 to go, I suppose. Uh... Bear with me. I'm just thinking back. <sighs> 297? Because we saw it down there? I doubt it. What about... Didn't it say, like, remember the time of your login? Something like that on the other side of the door. Let me just have a look at that again. The exact time of your login. Okay. And I've noticed that that clock hasn't changed at all. So it's 422 or 423? I think. Or it might be 323 or something. No, I think it's 4. Sure. Okay, we could try that. We could try that. If if that doesn't work, I guess I'll play around with the cryptex or maybe end the video and ask you for your help. Anyway, let's uh let's play around with this. Let's try. 423. Yes! Yes! Right! 
uh, it, it turned the monitors on. Is that all it did? Did it unlock the door? <laughs> I'm kind of hoping to go even further into this mystery, you know? Right, so yes, this is how he was monitoring me from this room, alone. The bedroom. The bathroom. That lounge area. And... The study just out there. Why is there an exclamation mark on that? This is... this is bizarre. This has all been one big test. Okay, I'm wondering why there's an exclamation point on this one. The other ones don't seem to have that. Is that because that's where I am right now? It's paused, apparently. Interesting. Well, they're all paused. So, hang on, can I, like, get these to play or something? Or rewind? Can I watch myself going around? It's just the password. Really? This entire thing is just for a password. That's unbelievable. <laughs> Everything else is so high-tech, that just seems pointless to me, but okay. So there's cameras in every room? Let's just have a look at this one, so... That's, it's gonna be to the... It's gonna be in the far corner from the door. Like, over there. Wait. The vents? Is that how they're seeing me? It's the vents? Hold on. Hold on. Ah, oh, I'm just a little bit too short. If only I had something to step on. Let's see if I can take that off and... I, I think there must be a there must be a camera up there. What, what about the other ones? Hang on, let's just go through the other rooms. So there's one like... Right! There's a vent there! This is making too much sense now! Um... Where else? I think there was one... I think it was over here. Yep, a vent again. Yep, and I do believe actually that there was a vent in the bathroom as well. Up there, right. They're not quite aligned by the looks of it. Very strange, okay. This is unbelievable, I'm still trying to process this, honestly. Okay, well, we're in the bathroom, so... Let's take another look at this, I suppose? Yeah, okay, let's have a look at the cryptex. I'm pretty sure these symbols are the same. Yeah, it looks like it. It looks like there's there's one from the left, and then there's one from the top. Are we having a very complex game of Battleship here? Tell you what, bear with me guys, I'm gonna write this down, and I'll see if I can figure this out after that. Okay, so I've written all the symbols down. It's, it's like there's six that I need to do. I'm thinking that I need to make those particular reference points, let's call them, red. Or maybe I have to leave them blue and make everything else red. It's probably one of the two. So, okay, to start off we have like the ear shape symbol, which is this one over here, and then the triangle, which is actually this one here. So, do we need to make this red, or do we need to make this blue? Okay, let's assume we need to make it blue, okay? So, let's let's do this. Let's make it so that everything everything's red, pretty much, at the moment. Okay? And then we can sort of take this all back, if we need to. So, what's the next one? It is the... Okay, it's the ear, and then it's the one that's sort of like a sideways T. This one over here, I think, with a dot, yeah? So this one needs to be blue as well? Like so? Yeah? Okay. There's two down, four to go. Okay, next one is uh, this symbol here, and then it's this symbol here. Which I can't change, probably because of this. Oh, no, sorry, this. Ah. I'm seeing it. Ah, right, okay. Let's leave it like that. That seems to work. I'm getting this. Okay, uh, next up is on the third row down. It is this one again. This one needs to be like that. Yeah? What about this one, though? Mm, yes. I think so. If I've written that down correctly, yes. Okay, the next one. Or well, the last one, really. This one actually isn't a part of the puzzle, apparently. This one is, though. I need to make it so that this one is also working. So, let's see. Uh, like that? No, hang on. I've... Oh! Oh! What? I just did it, I think! I've got it! What is that? It's the R for the typewriter! It's the R for the typewriter! I don't know why I'm shouting. I'm so happy. Okay. <laughs> Keep it. Keep it. 
So that was all to get an R for the typewriter. Are you serious? What the f Okay. Alright, I was expecting perhaps a little more, I've got to be honest, but that's... that's amazing. So now we can fix the typewriter. So now I guess we can type whatever we want. But what do I type? Well, there is one word that comes to mind because of the Science Odyssey magazines, and it's Benefactor. And that has an R. So... I'm, I'm assuming it's something that I couldn't actually write out without getting the, the, the key, so... Right, let's see, let's see. I'm really hyped up right now. Okay, so... We put it back. Brilliant. Okay, so... Benefactor? B? E? N? E? F? A? C? T O R. I can't type anymore, and I did just hear something. Whoa, hang on. What? What on earth? I, uh, okay. State power hierarchy machinery. We're science. Of course you are, of course you are. What on earth is this? Okay, so... Oh, we move them around, I see. So we've got to try and figure out coordinates. It's got to... It's got to relate to the, the globe behind me, I would think. And then we'll enter. Right. We can switch between the two. Wow, there are a lot of combinations here, it looks like. Yeah, trial and error isn't going to cut it this time. It's got to reference something on the map. Exodus... And arrival, or, or just Exodus, seems to be highlighted. Can I change that? No, I can just... I just turn... I just uh, change the handles. I can't interact with the end, uh, the, uh, the center at all. Okay. I'll tell you what, guys. Thank you very much for watching. What I'm going to do is ask you for your help. Perhaps you can help me out with this puzzle. I guess we have to work out the coordinates for somewhere on the map. Exodus. Is that a biblical reference? Arrival. Is arrival mentioned? In Exodus, perhaps? Are we looking for a biblical verse? Do we need prior knowledge? Maybe I'm overthinking it, I don't know, but uh, if you can leave any hints and tips in the comments below, that would be much appreciated. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you in part five, which will hopefully be along very soon. See you then. Restricted area? Oh, <laughs> not to me, apparently. Okay, two sheets of paper. What? Sure. Okay, let's go back round here. Oh god. Oh, what the fuck? I just noticed, and I feel stupid for saying this, but I just noticed there wasn't actually a wall here. Yeah? No. Okay. Well, 999 to go, I suppose. 423? Yes! Yes! Like that? No, hang on. I've... Ooh, ooh. What? I just did it, I think! T? O? Ah. Oh. I can't type anymore, and I did just hear something. Whoa, hang on. What?